July 15, 2013. Hello again. So, Labor are the party of the working person, are they? Now, I like to consider myself left of center, but let's ask the obvious fucking question. Who the fuck do you define as the working person? The whole concept conjures up images of men emerging from down coal mines with blackened faces and women with headscarfs shattering away as they are lost in row after row of sewing machines, but that's just not the case anymore. I reckon the fuckers are being deliberately vague cause they haven't got the fucking clue themselves. Unless your money comes from inherited wealth, surely doesn't everyone work for their money from Vinman to Twisted Fucking Spunk Stain Banker. Aren't they all working class? Maybe Shrek has the answer. I mean Wayne Rooney, sorry. The fucker is paid so much money he could wipe his arse on tenors but despite his gold. Plated fucking lifestyle the ape could buy fucking him fucking palace and he'd still not be able to escape the fateful truth. The fucker is clearly working class. So is it where you're born, who your parents are, or how you speak? Or does it fucking matter? Maybe what really matters is looking at those cunts who do fuck all for a living. Those lazy bastards who sit on their arses all day long, kicking back and chilling while the rest of us have to go out to work and craft for what we have only to have our pockets fucking picked for the tax to fund those cunts lives of fucking Riley. Designer gear and flat screen fucking televisions, the lot. That's the real problem. Something needs to be done about those sponging fucking no marks who think the world owes them a living. Maybe there is only one solution, and harsh but necessary solution. The abolition of the monarchy so the lazy bastards have to go out and earn a fucking living for a change.